Besoin d'un plan de jeu pour votre défense numérique Utilisez Surfshark, VPN en un seul clic. Une centaine d'emplacements, 3200 serveurs, appareils illimités. Surfshark, gagnez le match de la sécurité. Activez Surfshark dès maintenant. Chanté. Bonjour, ça va bien Ça va et toi ah, Très bien. Comment tu juges ton début de saison How do you judge the start of your season uh, Bien, I think for me it's, uh, it's good to get started in the right way. We won some games, hard draw, lost some. But in general, I think uh, we are not where we want to be. But we are getting closer by every game. Have you imagined to be like in this level with seven goals? I think for me as a striker, the goal is to score as much as possible every game. And uh, I'm very much around really good players who are really helping me with the ball. Most of the goals I've scored is good passes from my teammates. So I don't think so much about uh, who is in front or who is behind me. It's a very long season, so right now I'm focused on every game. Tomorrow is like another game, just that it is with Paris Saint-Germain. And uh, we just have to go there and give our best and see what happens. Most important is to win. Do you feel like you're, you're in the spirit of the team with your teammates of Montpellier? Yeah, I think I, I didn't do the preseason, so coming into one week before the league, it's a... Uh, It takes time, but I think so far, three months, it's been good chemistry. The guys are really great guys and everybody's helping me to really settle in, so I would say yes. Yeah. Against PSG, do you know which uh, uh, jersey are you going to ask from the other players of PSG? I think personally for me, it depends on how the game goes. If the game goes really bad, I don't feel like talking or doing any of that. But Kylian would be nice to have his shirt. Are you happy with the, the situation where you're in general? Yes, I'm je suis content. I'm happy with uh, where I am. And uh, it's a good place for me to grow as a young player. And I have everything that I need here. So I'm happy with my decision. The club is treating me well. I have a very good group around me and I'm satisfied. Is uh, Paris Saint-Germain a special match for you? Like I said, it's just another game, but it's against Paris Saint-Germain, that's Articles, all. Articles, uh, journalism, everyone is uh, speaking about you. Do you feel any pressure? No, I block out every noise. I Because, for example, Messi won the Ballon d'Or and he was back in training the next day. The thing with football is uh, the work keeps us humble. You have to train every day, so I block out every noise. It's good that you get noticed for what you do, but you would not be here if I'm not scoring goals. So. That's the most important for me. It's a lot of goals, but in the match you still uh, score amazing goals. How do you explain this secret of you? Uh, I think we train to get better, and that is what I try to do every day. I will miss some, I will score some, I will even play bad in some trainings or some games. But the most important for me is to, on the game days, You have maybe two chances, you have to at least convert one because we have to score and I am the man who is in front of the goal. So I think the game makes it even more uh, critical to, to score the goals and yeah. What did you feel like uh, after your first goal against Toulouse? I think uh, knowing where we are as a club and how much the victory meant to us, giving us an opening goal was uh, important. That was an important goal for me and also for, for the team and uh, it meant a lot because it, gives, it gave us an edge over Toulouse in the first half which is also really important. Uh, teammates, how do you feel like is like the connection, like chemistry wise, do you feel like there's chemistry? Uh, I think like uh, every team, uh, people have to trust you to be able to depend on you more and more. Uh, like I said, there was no pre-season so coming into the season and trying to get the chemistry and the flow. Honestly, so far so good. I will not get the pass on every run, I know that. But we have brilliant players, Teji, Musa, Joris, Jordan, Wabi. Like, we are getting there, getting the chemistry, getting the flow. So I would say it's been good. I can't complain, even though there should be more passes, but I can't complain. Are you tired? Do you feel like you have the energy, no pressure? With the coming in? 
Uh, I think I, of course, I'm young and I get as much rest as possible. I do what I can do. I played uh, 17 games before coming and for the body that is a lot but here in Montpellier we have I think one of the best uh, medical staff they help us with uh, everything we need and yeah I'm taking care of my body as much as I can so I think I can go on yeah he said that his position is starting to be a little bit behind you how do you feel like is there a connection between two, you two uh, I think Savani needs no introduction. He's uh, maybe the best number 10 in the league. He's, uh, I call him magician. He's, he knows what to do every time. So I think for me, I can only make it easy by making the right runs. Teju will always find me. And we have seen from all the games. And So I think there is a connection in terms of he knows what to do and I just have to make the runs. Do you hope playing the can the African uh, Cup with your national team? I think national team is the dream of every boy who grew up in his country, and for me, it's also the same. But right now, I think uh, it's still one, two months away. The games in Montpellier are my biggest focus, and that would come when it comes, and then we'll see with the club. Well, an objective. Uh, I don't have a limit, but at least one goal every game. Il n'a pas de limite, mais un but chaque match. So most of your goals are in the end of the match. Do you feel like is it annoying or no? Uh, that's a complicated question. <laughs> but I would always be a player who respects the decision of the coach. Always is uh, they see better from outside. And yes, I am not happy going out of the pitch. No player is. But, and I scored most of my goals, I think, this year, uh, over 70 minutes. Uh, that's also the decision of the coach. If he chooses to let me play more, okay. If he says uh, Kelvin comes in, okay. But in general, no. I like to stay in the pitch as long as possible. Uh, how do you judge the French league compared to the Norwegian league? I think, the, of course, it's a much bigger league. It's top five. Uh, the intensity is different, the physicality in the way the games take a lot and also anybody can beat anybody so that is uh, special also and the quality of the players is also different. Uh, which position, how do you like to play the way you like to play, do you like to have more space or not? Uh, I think I enjoy football more when I can play on my strength. It's like running the back spaces, uh, uh, crosses, and uh, I don't want to be touching the ball all the time. I want to be like, I'm a box player. So if I can create so much in the last third, I enjoy it very much. Big strikers, do you have like an idol in your position? Because Sunday, last Sunday, you made you made them think that you're like Dennis Burkham. <laughs> uh, his touches are magnifique. But uh, personally, I think I, I watch uh, Ronaldo Nazario, Arnav, and uh, Didier Drogba, yeah. So he doesn't believe that this match is like any other match. You're going to enter Parc des Princes. Uh, how do you feel like your destiny is going to be? I think I'm excited. It's, uh, it's an adventure for me. I have not been there before, so my expectations are very open. Anything can happen. And yes, it's not every other game because it's Paris Saint-Germain. But at the end of the day, it's three points, zero point, or two points. Uh, One point, sorry. Yeah. <laughs>